Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of... Why are you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. Now we're off to... Hello, everyone, and thank you for coming back to the channel. Yes, and we got Nini out here once again. Nini is out here once again. Uh, how you call it? She is partaking of the man, the married man, the Shaba man, the scammer man. Okay, evidently she don't know these people, so we're going to position it to be scammer man's friends this is scammer man right there shopper all right we won't even call him his real name because we just see him as a fake individual putting nini through unnecessary changes the white woman i don't know where she comes from who she with or any of that okay but we got nini can't stand the light i don't know why i'm like are you a vampire baby but anyway don't know who this lady is. Might be Nene's friend. Might be, I don't know, a bartender. Who gives a shit, right? But this white woman was in there jamming to some black music. I said, oh, Lord, she got a little soul in herself. So I'm like, mm, she must be with the birthday boy. But Shaba Man looks like he wants her to back it up on him. Okay? Told you that man by that's my opinion that is just my opinion but they're doing this kid and play a uh, little dance that they did in house party i think it was two or maybe it was one i think it was house party one but anyway yep she's singing uh built built the vo the vo um sent a song called poison this girl's driving me out of my mind that's why it's hard for me to find. Can't get it out of my head. Miss her, kiss her, love her. That girl is poison. Honey, that's what she be trying to say. But I was like, uh uh, you all off tune and, and, and girl, girl. No, stick with what you know. Stick with what you know. All right? But I think the boy, the birthday boy, was in the, the one in the middle okay him the one in the middle and simon uh, simon i'm sorry uh scammer man and i don't know who the other man it was in that mauve type of a suit okay but they were having a life of their they were having a life of their time a time of their life i should be saying and of course that's a little shot from nini and scammer man out there at the BET Awards in California okay and they had Ray J so I'm thinking maybe they had them built around what um, sitcom or what show they're from because you had Ray J then you had um, Frida around there somewhere and of course you have Nene right there with Shabba Man, Scammer Man, however you want to see him, okay? That's who he is to me, and that's who he always will be, mainly because we can't tell heads or tails where Nene is going with all this foolishness, fakery, fraudulent fuckery things she's doing out here in these Atlanta streets, California streets, and she's going to be in them New York streets when they get her case together, okay? But yes, that's Shaba Man, that Scammer Man, out there with Nene. Uh, that was her date for the night. Of course, she's saying this is her friend now. But before that, she was saying that was her man, okay? Talking about some my hours, women, yours, mine's hours type of shit. And we're going to be seeing that 100K plus come out of her bank account. And... <sighs> <laughs> Shopper man ain't finna do nothing. He ain't finna pay nothing. He's just gonna get what he can get from all the women. He's making a, a fool out of his wife, and he's making a definitely fool out of Nene Leakes. Cause child, he got her in those plush sandals, flip flops, fuzzy wuzzies, however you want to see them, okay? 
he got Nene in him. She probably paid for him, but, you know, that's what Nene do, okay? Or that's what Nene has started to do, because I don't think she did it with Greg, okay? I don't think Greg saw the likes of Africa or Las Vegas or France, okay? Why she didn't take him on those trips prior to um, him being deceased or dying, Ah, uh, we never know. We never will know, okay? But she's out there playing around with a married man, and it's going to come back and haunt her one day. But we don't need no tears. We don't need no explanations because she's had several bloggers out there telling her to break the cycle. Break up with the man, leave him in the dust, and keep it moving. And stop Peter at, at, while she at it, okay? For setting you up with somebody that he knew was already still taken legally anyway. But yeah, honey, that ain't the idea. Uh, celebrating with some of uh, Shabba's friends. Because uh, it definitely ain't hers. Cause we, to tell you the truth, two things for certain and one thing's for sure. I ain't never seen any hang out with no Africans, no Liberians, no um, uh, Nigerians, none, okay? She always was with the black man. So what type of spice of life is she doing now? I will never know. But she will never have anything good to come to her when she's still in the midst of messing with a married man i don't know how we can get her to see what she's doing it's so wrong and uh, the man don't give a shit about her because if he did if he's been separated for a long time she should be asking him three years or more being separated why haven't he gotten a divorce it don't take that long i don't think they have those many assets because if he was worth a trillion or a billion dollars <laughs> i'm not a betting woman but i would take that bet he wouldn't have been looking at no nene leaks no he wouldn't have okay but nene lee has opened up the floodgates of the people that she do know in hollywood and if anybody that loves to dress um like a uh, scammer man puts his wardrobes together then he's not gonna need nene later on down the road if he keep getting into her circle of um, blackness, whiteness, I don't know how many friends or uh, different cultures Nene knows off, you know, the back of her hand. But, yeah, he can definitely, because uh, they're not going to judge him of being with Nene. They want the clothes that he seems like he has available. And they are nice suits that he can put together for a man or a woman so they're going to get what they need out of him and of course pay his price that he's asking but that's about it and once he get his clientele off of the back of nene leaks he's gonna leave her how you get them is how they leave you. That's all I got to say. I ain't got no more for this video. Y'all like it, love it, gotta have more. And you know I will bring, be bringing y'all more because this is the eve of 4th of July. So happy 4th of July. Okay, to all my YouTube family members, be safe out there. Don't let people get on your nerves because Lord knows I had somebody get on my nerves today and I even got in an argument with the folks. Okay, and that just wasn't like me. But I shouldn't have been out there in the first place because it was just too crowded and people were just, you know, doing what they wanted to do. People going slow in front of you when you're driving and when you get in the line, they act like they can't get it together. You know, they call it don't work. Or they ain't ready to be moved out the way. You know, transaction has all been made. Um, purchases are already in your bag, but you still up at the register looking stupid as hell. But anyway, that was my day. I thought I'd just give y'all a little bit of how my day went. And I was like, mm -mm, maybe I'm getting a little bit too old to be fooling with foolishness. And I think that's basically it. But y'all be safe in them streets because you never know when you may come up uh in the midst of an idiot or some crazy person okay and we ain't trying to be out there like the wild wild west because people don't like to fight with them hands no more that's where everything would be uh taken care of because you would have definitely got your ass beat or you would have been beating somebody's ass you see what i'm saying 
and you live another day. But right now, how these people are focused out in this world, they ain't got time to tussle with you. They ain't got time to mess up their bodies and scrape up their knees and legs. They're just going to try to take you out. You know what I'm saying? Which is a cowardly way of doing it. But that's just how our society has gone. And I have to keep that in mind when I get upset or I have road rage and stuff of that nature. But that's all I wanted to say. Be safe. Don't eat too much. And I will see y'all next video. Bye-bye.